because I've always cared for, for animals. I've just always had a love and a passion for animals, but more specifically, how they, how they are treated. There's so much cruelty in the world today that how do you actually, and, and also so much information coming at us all the time, how do you actually stand out and get your message heard about something that you care about? People simply have no idea what's going on. I like to get up early in the morning, I breathe, take a nice bath, warm up, cool down, and then it's time to head over to the barn and to let the magic happen. But wait, let's start from the beginning. Well, I sat here with two friends one day in my house and I said, you know what? I've got this property next to my house. I'm building a barn to, to rescue farm animals. I always wanted to have rescued farm animals around me. And I said, I'm going to rescue a pig. I'm going to teach this pig how to paint or at least pick up a brush. The pig's gonna paint amazing paintings. She's gonna become world famous. She's gonna sell a ton of artworks. It's gonna sustain the project and everyone's gonna go vegan. People online are getting excited about pig Picasso. This here is a real Picasso. Picasso? Picasso. 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 Well, she's known as Pig Picasso. So how does the painting process unfold? Well, it's definitely teamwork. I select all the colors and I set things up. Picasso arrives at a wall, walks towards the canvas and picks up the brush. She'll do a few strokes, then she retreats for a snack and returns again. And so it goes. I watch from a distance and I'm able to stop her when I see her making a stroke that looks unique or different or when I believe the artwork is complete based on the composition. When the painting is done, she dips her nose in a vegan ink and signs the artwork with a nose tip. I then name, date and sign it. Most of the artworks come with a video and everyone includes a certificate of authenticity. Picasso loves to paint. She only paints when she wants. Uh, she's a boss around here and she pretty much runs the show. It's a very unique process, okay? And it gets very messy around here. I never know what's gonna happen. And we have a lot of fun creating these artworks. That's where the collaboration comes in. Picasso is the artist, creates the artwork, but it's the, it's the creative human invention when I'm looking at it that, that creates a combination for viewers to understand it better in a human dimension. The proceeds of our art benefit the sanctuary too. It's just such a creative and rewarding way to sustain what we do around here for the animals, for the people, and for a greater vision of inspiring a kind of way. The fact that this art is so unique gives it its value. I mean, if you gave 8 billion people on the planet a paintbrush, they'd all pick it up and paint something. Give that same brush to 8 million pigs and well, there's only one that'll pick it up and paint. That's what gives us art extraordinary value. Keep, 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 keep. She's like such a gentle, look at that. And if you look at her eyes, they're so human, unbelievably human. Picasso! Picasso! 2022 NFTs, Hello Future. Uh, great uh, excitement over this. It'll be the first time that an animal will be um, releasing NFTs. That's a huge moment for, for Picasso and the project. She will only be releasing 2,400 NFTs, so very limited edition. And uh, I think, you know, what's amazing is that, you know, there's a, lot of, um, there's a lot of artists on the blockchains now, but there's only one animal and there's only one Picasso, and we think it's going to rock and roll. This is the first collaboration in history between a human and an animal. I feel so grateful for this opportunity. It's just a privilege to be able to be creating side by side with this extraordinary, amazing pig. 
It's art with a serious message, art to shake up the status quo and a means to awaken people to thinking differently about food, to think differently about art and ultimately because art is all about inspiring a kinder, more sustainable world for all.